Hello, this is Kitty Girl 54321. You're probably wondering, why are we looking at the back porch? Well, that's because I'm getting ready for another episode of Storytime. And this episode is called... Where Lion Came From. Okay, you probably don't recognize Lion because he's from an older video. And he's been gone since then. So, basically I'll tell you like this. One day on Wednesday in February, the same week we got Orion, a black cat showed up on the porch. And my mom was curious about him. Turns out he had actually been wandering around and came onto our porch to look for the to get away from the cold. So, mom went out there, and it took her until the third time to be able to touch him. And when she was able to, she went and got the cat carrier, brought it to the porch, and put him inside and brought him inside. I mean, put him inside the carrier and then brought him into the house. Five minutes later, I came home from school. And noticed the cat carrier sitting in the dining room. Curious, I peeked into the carrier to see who the cat was. I mean, to see what was in there the cat that I just mentioned. Since I was home, we put the dog away and we let the cat out of the carrier. And boy, was he a mess. He was skinny, dirty, and limping. Poor thing. <laughs> Luckily, over time, we managed to fatten him up by giving him healthy food. The next day, he stopped limping and his fur wasn't so dirty. We gave him the name Kedalion, but we shortened it to Lion. Although Lion was only one of his names, he had several others. We called him Headlights because his eyes looked like headlights. We also called him Eric because he was a happy cat. And we called him Haas because he was so talkative. You wonder what Lion was like? Well, just watch videos on... Just watch any video that involves the cat Natasha. Because Lion is very much like Natasha. And vice versa. And that's it for today's story time. So stay tuned for more videos in the future. Be perfect. Subscribe.